What's up guys, and in this video, yes, you saw the title and the thumbnail, right? We are playing Kieran the Toten, but we are only we allowed to power. use wall buyers. So we're only allowed to use guns that are on the wall that we can purchase off said wall. Uh, so that means we cannot hit the mystery box at all. Like, nothing. If you see me hit the mystery box, I if I hit the mystery box, I have to restart the whole entire run. Okay? Those are the rules. I really do appreciate everyone's support on my most recent videos. I really do appreciate it. And if you leave a comment on my, if you leave a comment on this video, I will show you out in the next video. Just let you guys know. It's it's just a way of me to say thank you to everyone that gets, supports me uh, and all, all the rest of it. And I love to see on how slow my channel is growing. It's just it's just a good thing. It fills me with such joy to see my channel grow. Uh, I have been doing YouTube for like five years now, but this year has really been like the grind year, I feel like for me, where I've just constantly done videos, but I've never done videos two weeks in a row straight, like co constantly, and I'm going to keep on going until the end of the year, so I really do, do hope you guys enjoy that and enjoy every single video that I make. Uh, what's this, what's this, I keep on opening up doors and all the rest of it. Uh, let's talk about, um, that the incident with, uh, Jimmy and all the rest of it, like that, Mr. Beast incident. Um, it's like a big incident. Uh, if you don't know about it, you don't know about it, that's fine. Uh, Mr. Beast, uh, not Mr. Beast himself, but someone that works with Mr. Beast, or his friend, uh, Chris, or whatever she wants to be called, or whatever. It, uh, she was a guy and then transferred over to female, I'm pretty sure. Um, but yeah, that, that's not the whole thing, but you know. He, she, whatever their pronouns are, uh, has apparently, allegedly or apparently been chatting up minors um, ever since they have made the transformation to female. Uh, now, I don't know if this is true or not, but if it is... That's nah, just ridiculous and just awful. And then people are, have the audacity to say that Mr. Beast, Jimmy, has known at this side of Chris or whatever they're called um, since um, because of them knowing each other for such a long time. That is such a terrible reason. Like, I know my, I've known my friend. Uh, I can't say his name for a very long time. He's not my friend anymore because of the stuff that he used to do. I found I found out a year after for a of what he does, and when as soon as I found out, I tossed him aside. That's simple as that. But to I, I don't I don't get it. Like it's just stupid. Just to come up with that assumption that yeah, anyway, it's enough of that talk. Let's talk about this beautiful map. I know I've played this map like maybe twice on the channel, but the map is just such a good map. I just can't stop playing it. This shotgun, the Argus, is actually pretty good as well. It's like a one shot. I don't know on how long it's going to be a one shot for, but it's a one shot at the moment. Well, it is on round three, so of course it's going to be a one shot. It's a bloody shotgun. Um, <laughs> my goal in this uh, game is to get to round 30. Uh, again, I really want to do that, and if we get to round 30, I will not edit this video. Actually, no, I will have to edit this video because of the topics that I just literally talked about. I just literally talked about a landmine. Like, if anyone doesn't like what I just talked about, I can get banned, basically, or get cancelled. Because a lot of topics I want to touch on and talk about, I can't talk about because they're sensitive. And some people may not like my opinion. So I have to censor myself half the bloody time. <laughs> it's just a whole thing, really. <clears throat> I do hope everyone enjoys this video. It's, uh, I think it's just going to be just a video of me just talking about random stuff. I mean, that's, that's the usual, really. I never plan my videos. Uh, so that's, I've completely forgot what I was talking about. <laughs> uh... Uh, yet again, this guy reminds me of the guy from Infinite Warfare, like that demon-looking guy. Uh, I'll probably pop it up on screen somewhere. Um, what it reminds me of. 
if I'm able to find it. Uh, if you see random memes throughout the video, it's because I decided to add a random meme, okay? Don't question it, just read it and laugh to it. That's all I ask. And if you guys want to suggest uh, video ideas, let me know. And I'll try and do those video ideas. Um, so, and I'm already going to be playing the hell out of, like, Call of Duty Black Ops 6. Like, I'm going to milk that to what it's worth. Like, I'm going to do the Easter eggs, or try to at least, when they get released. I'm going to do one box challenges, wall buy challenges, hit the mystery, I get a new gun, like, every single round. I'm going to be doing everything on, on that game. In zombies, and I'm just going to be doing the camo grinds, the just everything that I can possibly do. So, if Black Ops 6 gets boring, I do apologize about that, but I'm going to milk the hell out of it, and I hope you guys enjoy it. If it gets too boring and all the rest of it, I do apologize. Just let me know, and I will switch up the games that I play from Black Ops 3, Black Ops 2, and all the rest of it. If you guys want me to play Cold War, I'll play Cold War. I have played Cold War before, so it won't be a first experience for me. But I'll definitely play it. I mean, it'll be a first for, like, the YouTube channel, I think. Actually, no, because I've played Dime Machine uh, on this channel before. It was a stream. I didn't edit the video. I know. Crazy. I edit every single video that I bring up my YouTube channel now. It's just a thing that I do. Because I... Ever since I started editing my videos, I just can't go out without editing a video. I know with my Ascension video, I didn't edit like half of that video. It's because I wanted to release that video uh, soon and not cut out like the game to round 30 at all. It was such a awesome thing in that, that happened, you know? And I wanted to give you guys the experience. Uh, would you guys be interested to have non-edited videos and edited videos? Like, I record a video, upload the non-edited version, so and watch you guys are watching the non-edited version, I'm editing the video, and I post the edited vi video, like, after that. So you guys get two videos? I mean, they'll be two of the same videos, but they'll be different. One will go for an hour, one will go for 20 minutes, basically. Is would you guys be interested in that? Because I know a lot of people are rather big videos and a lot of people are rather short videos. So yeah, let me know in a, in a comment section down below on what you would want to see if you want both or you, you just want one, one or the other. That's all I'm asking. Now, we had no idea the mystery box, so yeah, that's fun. <laughs> I reckon... We should pack a punch a gun that we've never pack a punch before. I reckon we pack a punch. Oh, let's go and grab the gun real quick and I'll show you guys the gun. We are going to pack a punch the Shiva and, and to see on how good it is because we all know the base gun is bloody terrible. Not joking. Uh, most of the spawn room guns are terrible, anyways, but the RK5 is pretty good on the Shadows of Evil. Uh, good point builder. No, you know what the Shiva reminds me of? The SMR from uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 2. Uh, I'll pop up the SMR uh, on screen. It is a single fire gun like this one. And it doesn't really kill zombies. It literally only does damage. Well, it doesn't even do that. It's literally just a point gun. Um, it takes like 10 rounds or 10 bullets to kill one zombie on round like 5, 10, I think. I might be over-exaggerating, but it's just the worst gun in Black Ops 2. Which is ridiculous. Oh crap, I completely forgot to get a uh, quick revive. It always sucked if we, if we like took it down and then we just fully died. Then the run would end. That would suck. Ah, uh, now that's grabbed, we have Cricket Vibe now. Right. Yay! It is okay. a bit fishy. Uh, the mystery box, we don't care where that is. <laughs> we don't really, we don't need it. At all. Oh, what's well, gonna show up on screen? Nothing. Oh, never mind. Wait, what? Oh, it's just constant counter. Okay. Cool. Now, where the hell is the last zombie? Last zombie, where are you? That's why I'm going crazy. Where the... Oh, there he is. 
That was a terrible hind spot. Wait, that wasn't even the last freaking. Oh, there it is. That wasn't even a lot. Bruh. And a thing of beauty. I'm gonna see if I can do this glitch right here and see if it's actually still. Never mind, it's not even gonna work. Uh, the, uh, in the last video, I think, or the video before that, in one of the videos, someone, uh, Uwu Spuddy uh, commented there used to be a glitch, Howhound glitch, on this map. He would be right. Uh, what, would, what you would do. Ah, uh, could I just leave it? Oh my bloody god, that scared the shit out of me. Um, we'll, we'll go, we'll, we go up here and sit on this corner, and there's, uh, things will go right here. Like, the Howhounds will go, like, caught up in that little area. My god, that scared the shit out of me. I nearly died. I, yet again, I hate the fact that the zombies hit so gosh damn quick. Like, they hit quicker than, like, your mum finding out that you got suspended from school. <laughs> uh, whoever got, ever got suspended from school uh, knows the feeling of getting whipped by the belt by their mum. Uh, I'm still a kid, classified as a kid. Uh, with the youth crime, it's so big at the moment. Like, I see a lot on the news of youth crime in Australia. It's ridiculous. Like, and they get away with it too because they're not classed as adults. They, if they're above, like, the age of 12 or 14, they obviously know what they're bloody doing. If they do it once, yeah, they can get away with it. That's fine. I, I don't care. You learn, you, you live, you learn from your experiences. But if you purposely, if you do something and then you get in trouble with it, trouble, and then you go out and do the exact same thing, that's just deliberatism. By deliberatism, it means... Doing the same thing even though you know it's bad. I think deliberatism is uh, a thing, maybe. I don't know. If it isn't, uh, I've made out, made up a word, okay? <laughs> Fight me later. Yeah, but youth crime is crazy. I, I don't hate all of Gen Z. I'm not saying that because I'm, I'm a part of Gen Z. But, you know, some, are, some people are just... Some of the teens from my generation are just... Uncontrollable. Alright, now we just... We need die, speed collar. Um, this shotgun is actually really good. It's still a one-shot in round 8, which is awesome for wall buy. You know, it's, I'm, I'm starting to think this uh, wall buy challenge isn't even that hard. It's pretty easy. This is proper hey. socialist reform. We, when we like, run out of ammo, we can just like get ammo from the wall buy, so it's not that hard. So it's technically not a challenge, but it's still a challenge. This shotgun is putting in mad work right now. Holy crap. We might get to round 30 with this just this shotgun alone. Round 9, baby! Let's go! How good. Uh, I think my dinner is almost ready, so we might have to pause this and then like, uh, come back to it. Fetch me their souls! Oh, what a great sound to hear. I think I'm like the only one in the zombies community that loves Hellhounds. Like, I remember the first time I've ever like dealt with Hellhounds, which was in, on Black Ops 2 Town Survival. Absolutely a blast when, like, when, it, when I first saw Hellhounds. I think the scariest boss, like mini boss, like on round five, round six, like every like, six, five rounds would have to be the clowns from Infinite Warfare. I know that's not a Treyarch game, but the cl having clowns chase after you that explode is just scary as... I don't care what anyone else says, it's just scary, okay? Like, if you see see them, you you would be scared too, okay? What if they had... What if they... If they bring them back, like... If they ever, ever... And another cool little mini mini boss, uh, what is the Tigers from Call of Duty Black Ops 4? Those are pretty cool. I, when I saw the Tigers for the very first time, that was I was my eyes were like, wow, that's really cool. Um, even though I've died to died to them a couple of times, I mean, who hasn't? I mean, I've died to Hellhounds for God's sakes. But the yeah, Tigers are pretty cool. Uh, we are not grabbing that nuke because we need uh, points to pack a punch. 
the Shiva. Yes, we are still pack a punch of Shiva, even though the shotgun is literally the better option. But, you know. Uh, let's go and uh, link the pads real quick. Alright, now that we have linked up the pads, and now we can go and pack a punch, which is fun. I think the most hated uh, mini boss would have to be, for me, it would have to be the Mangala. Not the Mangala, the freaking um, three headed yellow. Oh, are we accidentally pack a punch to shotgun? Well, oh well. Uh, we'll pack a punch to Shiva after, okay? Shake it, shake it. <laughs> Jesus Christ, why do you get stunned when you go through the portals? I mean, that's so stupid. Back to doing what we we're doing. We're gonna, we gotta save up more money to pack a punch to Shiva. Actually, no, we're gonna uh, get perks first. We're gonna get speed collar and, ooh, what should our fourth perk be? Double tap, double tap will come in handy. Um, even though I get less more bullets because your fire rate, your damage goes up. I think that's how double tap works. Maybe. I might be wrong though. Alright, I'm back. I decided to go and quickly get dinner. <laughs> uh, I'm having Chinese for dinner. That's pretty dope. How good? Wait, hold on. Wait, how did that zombie survive that? I literally shot him. <laughs> I mean, between rounds, I'm going to be eating, so that's fun. I think uh, what we're going to do is we're, so we're probably not, we're not even going to upgrade the Shiva because there's no point. Uh, we already know it's going to be terrible. We're going to pack a punch the MP5, I think is what it's called. Uh, we got minigun. You know, last time we got minigun on this uh, map, uh, we took an unfortunate down because of a crawler that I didn't see at my feet. Crawlers are the most deadliest thing in this goddamn game because a lot of the time I don't even look down at all. Eradication. Why? What the? Are you running? Why are you running? Huh? That 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 zombie didn't want to die to me like at all. Uh, let's go and get a uh, speed collar shell. Ah, drink this, man. Okay. I, I really hope now? we get to round 30. That is my one goal. We haven't gone down yet, and it's round 12, which is really good. Now, if we get to round 20 without taking it down, that's even better. You know it'd be even better if we don't go down at all and we get to round 30. It'd be crazy. Um, but I seriously doubt it. With with my luck, I'll guarantee get down um, before round 30. Mainly because of the Nova crawlers, they suck. I I feel like if they didn't explode, it would be way easier uh, to survive on this map. But I do suppose they probably were, like put Nova crawlers in this map because it was easy. Man, it is still. Decently easy once you get used to used to like Kino the Totem. Let's be honest here. It's like town. Dude. It's a survival map that you, you can easily get pack a punch on. You can easily survive, get weapons, you know, get perks really easily. It's just it's just a blast really. Ah, right, now let's get doubles up. You know what? Before just before Call of Duty Black Ops 6 comes out, I'm going to try and do a round 50 run. I try to get to round 50 on Call of Duty Black Ops 3. Now, I don't know what map is the easiest to get around 50. I'm going to do some research to see which one's the easiest. And do get around 50 on that map. And maybe Kino to Totem, to be honest with you. Because Kino to Totem is pretty easy to get to the high rounds. Once you get the Thunder Gun, you're pretty much unstoppable. Because when you get the Thunder Gun and you get into a corner, those zombies don't stand a chance. You'd be like, they'd be like, I want to touch, touch your willy, and they'd be like, no, nope. and you'd be like, nah, go away. Oh yeah, and um, we have a perk um, uh, uh, in no our gum gum that lets us go down three flight. times. That's free activations. And guess what? Where All three times we get to keep our perks. I think on round twenty we're gonna pop that gum gum so we don't have to uh, re grab our perks. I know it's cheating, but I'm at. It, look, it's my video. I can do whatever the fudge I want. Okay. I don't care if you guys, if you guys don't don't, oh, don't want me to do it. I'm doing it. Not wall power. We we don't need wall power. Not at all. Man, it would be good for this uh, challenge, but not on this map. We don't need it. 
Ah, right, let's pop it again after it's ready. Real quick. Ah, right, let's pop it. What do we get? Fetch me the souls. Let's play Free. Fetch the grenade, right, demon let's spawn. just sit here and shoot the hellhounds. Ah, right, we have successfully killed all the hellhounds. Just good. with the doctor order. All right, now, let's spin this again real quick. We're on round 15. How good? Uh, okay, can I like spin the thing now, please? Ready, please, with a cherry on top. Can, can you like switch over to zero dollars? Thank you. Another purple gubba gum. We do not need extra credit. <laughs> no way. Man, we could have to like pack a punch the Shiva, but nah. I wonder how long this shotgun's gonna be a one tap for. Man, we haven't double packed it yet, so. I wonder. Hip fires. Ooh, 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 ooh. You know what's something that I really want to talk about? On like people hate to see people that are more successful than them, like get more successful than them. So they try and bring them down to their level. It's like it's how bullies like pick and choose their enemies, you know. They see someone that's uh, that looks like they're doing better than them and they start to pull strings, you know. That's how bullying works, or well, most of the time. Alright, let's link the pads. Please. Uh, can I link the pads, please? Right, can I. What the fu- What? Why can't I link the goddamn pad? Excuse me. This is illegal. Um. Wait, hold on. Do we have. Have we already linked it? Question mark? I have no idea. I guess we're about to find out, eh? Oh. We already linked it. Okay, cool. I was, I'm just being a spaz. Uh, let's go and pack a bunch of Shiva, shall we? And see on how it does. Alright. Now that we have packed a bunch, let's have a look. Oh, it's a one shot to the head. That's not too bad. Around 15. And for the Shiva, I, I, that's regarded as the baddest. Like, I don't think it's regarded as the baddest. I don't think. But I regard the Shiva as one of the worst spawn room ball buys. Uh, yeah. Oh, we're in the doctor's uh, area. Uh, I need a teeth checkup, please. <laughs> uh, uh, yet again, I hate the fact that you get stunned every single time you go through the bloody portals. Round 16, chap. The Shiva is actually not too bad. Like, once you start using it, like, his headshot multiplier is not actually that bad. But I don't think high rounding with the Shiva is gonna be an easy task, that's for damn sure. That's why we're not gonna high round with it. We're only gonna use it for this round to point build. That is it. And then we're gonna grab the MP5 and pack a bunch of that. I have issue. Okay, and minigun time. Uh, that's the start and get the fuck away from me. Double points? Oh my god, look at many freaking things I have. Okay, we can almost pack a punch the uh, MP5 that we are about to go grab. Actually, now let's uh, pack a punch this gun. This gun is awesome. It's a high round on. I, I think I was on like a pretty high round with this gun and it was still doing damage. Uh, round 20, here we come, gamers. Uh, let's hit the gobble gun machine real quick. Uh, please give me what I want. And that's not what I want, but okay. <laughs> I wish you can pick and choose, like, on what gobble gum like, you can, like, activate. But no. It's all about the luck of the draw. It's like the mystery box in that way. Uh, we're showing up these zombies real quick. And then start beaming them down. That was a terrible idea. Okay, wrap around. Go this way. This is a chill little gameplay. Wait. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh my god. This is really... Man, at least this gun is way better than Shiva. I mean, look at that. It just melts, bro. It just freaking melts. It is insane. Nice ammo, let's go. 
Uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna link the teleporters and then we're gonna pack a punch this gun. Because we can do that. We can uh, pack a punch this gun twice. How good? Uh, let's go do that. I've never had the issue on teleporting or whilst my gun has been in the pack a punch. Uh, but if that would ever happen to me, I don't think, I don't even think I would like play this game ever again. If I lost my pack a punch gun. Now that, I have lost my pack a punch gun in Die Rise, which is the reason why I hate Die Rise, because I put my gun in the pack a punch in Die Rise, right? And the freaking elevator went freaking. Oh my god, the zombies have already spawned. Okay, well, we're wrapping around, guys. And if you guys want me to play Die Rise, um, let me know in the comment section down below, because I will. If you suggest it, I will play it, you know? Just like if you guys suggest any other, like, maps and all the rest of it. Now, I cannot play custom uh, maps because I don't play on PC. Um, I may be upgrading the PC at the end of the year, maybe, but I record all my videos on Xbox die, and die, die. then I edit edit the videos uh, on my laptop, which I used to use for school. Um, so that's the reason why my videos aren't as high quality as I want them to be. Oh, I'm really trying to get the one gobble gum that I want. Is this the one? Yeah, it's this one. All right. I think Let's go. Now. Anyways, this is probably gonna be a really long video since we're getting to round 30. I'm not joking. I don't care on how much time I have to spend on this map. I'm gonna get to round 30. Oh, round 19, so satisfying, but not as satisfying as round 20. Oh, this gun just—I love it so much. I think it's my favorite um, Black Ops 3 map. Not map, uh, gun. Sorry. My favorite, like, zombie's gun. It's just so good. It just melts. It's like the Galil from, um, Black Ops 2. It just melts. There's just nothing you can do about it. Ooh, that was a really bad idea to do. My god. <laughs> Beam. Oh, I love it so much. Oh, it's figure beauty. Just to watch like 20 zombies just drop in my clip. The thing of beauty. Okay. And do it to speed up the rounds. Uh, we might as well double pack the shotgun. Or whilst we're at it. Ah, let's see what ammo mod we get on the shotgun. What ammo mod do we get? Turned. Uh, I don't like turn, but we'll keep it on the shotgun because why not? Don't worry, guys. And Nicolai Thunderwolf. That's a pretty good ammo mod as well because it pushes a lot. See? Look at that. I just sends the zombies flying. <laughs> oh, what a great freaking ammo mod. You know, it would be really OP if this map had a bank. That'd be bloody hilarious. <laughs> I mean, it's easy to build up points in this map because of how easy it is if you know the map well, like myself. And I've only played this map a handful of times. It's just a really easy map to get Die, used to Satan's the rest of it. Minions. No, let's use the shotgun, shall we? Um, might as well use all, both our guns up. Because if we use the same gun over and over again, this gets boring. Who likes boring gameplay? Bruh, why do these zombies just keep on going backwards and forwards every time I go near them? Like, come on, man. Round 20, let's go, gamers. Absolute poggers. I'm literally eating mid-rounds. Not joking. <laughs> I have my Chinese food right in front of me and I'm just eating during rounds. It's just a fun blast right now. Thunderwall is like really good. It's like fireworks. Blast furnace is also really good. I like all the ammo mods. I don't even think there's like one a bad ammo mod. To be honest. Uh, place down, uh, like a bad ammo mod that you hate in, uh, Call of Duty Black Ops 3. But I don't have one. Like, I can't think of a bad ammo mod. I know turn is pretty good because it's like an insta-kill, basically. If I did choose, like, a ammo mod that, that, ooh, that's a really hard thing. Like, you know what, I'll just, I'll just go with turn. Turn is the worst ammo mod for me. Because I... Thunderwolf is really good um, 
at like pushing zombies back. Blast furnace is good for killing zombies. Fireworks is even better because it kills zombies in a radius. Um, like it spawns like a gun from fireworks and it kills like zombies that are nearby, which is insane. To make it a little bit harder on myself, I'm not gonna get max ammo. Like I'm not gonna like go to a wall buy and get like the ammo from the wall by itself. We're gonna rely off the zombies and luck. Round 30 will be our stopping point. Maybe. You know what? Let's see on like how, how high of a round we get to. I want to push past 30. I have just made that decision. Now I'm probably gonna hate it because I'm gonna have to. If this video goes more more than two hours, I won't be able to edit it, and uh, yeah, it's just gonna be a full two-hour video. <laughs> uh, I don't think my laptop will be able to handle a two-hour long video. Oh my god, that is a really bad thing to happen. This shotgun is still a one tap on round 21. That is insane. Uh, I would be spinning the mystery box for the thunder gun, but I can't do that because, you know, that's not allowed. That's the wall by challenge only on Kino. Um, so, yeah. Oh, we got thunder wall on the shotgun as well. Let's go. Thunder wall on both guns. And we haven't gone down once. So, this is going to be a long run, guys. A long run. I'm telling you. A long, long run. I seriously doubt we gotta get to around a hundred because I don't have that that <laughs> I don't have the patience for that. <laughs> I can't sit for hours on end getting to around a hundred. No way. I'm not one of, one of those YouTubers like zombie YouTubers that can do that. Like I've never ever been to around a hundred on a zombies game. And getting to around a hundred on Black Ops 3 is like an ultimate flex that like most zombie, you zombie YouTubers have done. It's either they've been in the glitch to get to 100, around 100, or they've been in like a meta area to get it, like meta guns and all the rest of it, you know, to get to around uh, 30. Come on, zombies, spawn in quicker, please. Pretty please with a cherry on top. I'd really appreciate it if you spawn in faster. Be awesome. It's round 21, so active. My lord, where the are all the zombies, bro? Do the rounds go by quicker when you're in um the you pack punch room? Question mark. Like <laughs> Good thing I have a shotgun to do with these uh, hellhounds, because basically that's literally just a one tap for these hellhounds, and the hellhound round is a easy round to just go by, you know. Kill that hellhound. Kill that hellhound. Oh, look at that. Max ammo. How good. Make sure both guns are reloaded and grab the max ammo. And I seriously doubt I'm going to be, be able to get to round 50 without the thunder gun. Like, let's be honest here. I mean, after a while, guns start to do no damage. Point blank. Man, I can't wait to see a drop off on, on, this, on this AR because they didn't drop off enough. Uh, I got a ray gun question mark. Oh my god. Uh, well that was not good. It instantly revived me and well, it, right. I was only taking made, a and it let me keep all my perks. I completely forgot about the... That was a terrible down right there. I can't believe I went down there. That was absolutely not me. That wasn't me. Uh, my nephew had the controller. Definitely. It has gotten really hectic right now. Uh, round 30 is looking like a bit of a challenge because we, uh, the mega gum, gobble gum we have can only activate three times. We've only, we've already, we've already used one activation. It is round 23, so I expected for us to take it down. That's why I equipped it to gobble gum, so we didn't have to grab all our perks again. Uh, cause grabbing gobble gum, it, like, grabbing all the perks again, it's just so bad. Okay, so we gotta be really careful. Not to make any dumb moves. Alright, uh, I just sweaty. I don't have any audio on the zombies behind me, so some stuffed up reason. And it annoys me every single time that a zombie comes up behind me. But I don't have audio on them. Oh, we got max ammo. Let's go. We need that. Ah. 
We got nineteen thousand dollars. Let's go. And on round twenty-three, of all things. <laughs> and if we get past round thirty, that means we have broken our personal record because our personal record is round thirty on Ascension. I know, right? Already trying to beat my PR. My God, that. Oh Jesus Christ! I should have done that. Nuke. That should end around. Did it end around? Find out next time. Nah, it didn't end around. Okay, cool. Let's use the shotgun, shall we? Let's see if it's still a one tap. It is still a one tap. <laughs> this is a zombie. That zombie went flying. Another nuke? Oh, don't mind if I do. I'll pop that. Now, that should be the end of round 24. I got two nukes. <laughs> I got a nuke mid round. How the. Is it not the end of the round, bro? That's crazy. Um. I don't think you're supposed to die like that. Oh shit. I can't believe it's still a one tap. This is great. Absolutely love this shotgun. Now I usually hate shotguns, but I love shotguns in this map in this game. They're just absolute beauties. Round 25. <clears throat> we are gaming. I like the fact that I'm slowly getting better. Bruh, what the it was like, nah, man, nah, fam, I'm not, I'm not done to you. Man, just juke the shit out of me. <laughs> the hell, man? What the hell did I do to you? It's crazy. Uh, the shotgun's starting to get, become two tap now. Not the best, but it's alright. As I said, guns fall off. Remember, A to Sweaty, you go down one more time. You are screwed. Oop, nope, don't you dare touch me. Don't you dare touch me. You can't touch this. Yet again, I love Thunderwall. I guess this is... Oh my god. I, was, I literally just ran out of ammo. We got max ammo. How good. Look at that, an easy round. Let's go, gamers. Alright, let's kill these hellhounds and then we'll be on round 28. One by one, hellhounds. One by one, buddy. Okay. And in the end, you guys are gonna die anyway, so might as well one by one. You know, be great if I got like a free perk for killing hellhounds, and like they don't even touch me. That'd be great. It is happy hour. Round twenty-eight. Yes. <laughs> this is definitely a better like change of pace. Like yesterday's video, Shadows of Evil. That was. Just how? <laughs> I know I gave up like, after two Mark was spawning it, but I just couldn't be stuffed dealing with them. It's just, it was just a matter of me just not caring. <laughs> Giving up. I, I shouldn't have given up. I should have like um, played it through. But, you know. It was game boring as well. That's why I also stopped because I really didn't want to run around, run around the whole time trying to like oh my god I should need I should really concentrate um yeah yet again the thunder wall is just different oh my god oh my god that was really how the hell did you hit me twice nah that's such bullshit I'm over now. Okay. That that was even more bullshit. No way. No way. Oh my god. What the fudge cake just happened there? Oh, I lost my perks. I lost my perks. Oh shit. No way. We will have to revisit this. <laughs> There's no way. Oh, it's so stupid. Uh, if you guys enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe, like, and comment. And as always, I will see you all in the next one. Peace.